I want to teach you some exciting new concepts with your horse that I know are going to help you. So first of all, I want to give you a little exercise to help your lope off transitions. When you're riding your horse, many horses struggle with the lope off transition. If you're in a class or just anywhere, some horses get a little sassy about it and they even maybe jump into it or just don't make a pretty transition. And one exciting way to make really good transitions is to practice the setup at length. Now this is a mare who's on the sensitive side. She's sensitive in the face. And I think that in her earlier life, you know, somebody was real tough on her about things. And I'm always trying to build her confidence up. And for example, right now, I'm wanting to just ask her to position for the lope. So I'm real soft handed because she'd like to get over bridled or overreact a little to it. But notice how I'm just wanting to keep her body straight and her body, she's, she's willing to wiggle or, or get all um, antsy or quick legged with her feet. And so I'm going to come right at the camera and show you an example of what I might do. So I might just take a gentle hold of her and just push my left leg on for a right lead lope off and see how she wants to stick and stop. So I'm, I'm realized she's lacking confidence here and making bigger fast steps. So I got her to give her hip. She almost overgave it, but then she wanted to hesitate her flow. And one of the biggest secrets I could give you on getting a really good flow in your lope off transitions and a really good transition is that the horse accepts the setup position and continues with their flow. So for example here, we're going to ask her to push and continue forward. And now she's raised her head and moved her head. Our goal is that her head stays the same. And we just ask her to position. Now she's kind of biting at the bit. So I'll try again. I might spend an hour on each way or more. I'll spend what it takes to get my horse confident that I can just push him in position. Then when I'm ready to lope off, I'll squeeze kiss. This is better. This is better. She's giving me her hip, but allowing me to push her forward as well. I'll try her the other lead now. I'll do it off my right leg. Hold her in position. And now she's making a really big deal about it. She's over bending her hip, almost wanting to get dancy with her legs. It's okay, girl. I'm going to push. See, she wants to throw her body sideways and wants to jump into the lope. You're all right. You're all right. I just am holding my leg on her and just asking her to go forward and position and relax. And there she's getting edgy. Just go forward, girl. You're okay. And this is a sensitive mare. And when she's in heat, She's even different with it, but I, I just am encouraging her. And I'm not going to lope off out of here. I'm just going to encourage her and then drop her, let her relax. Again, I'm going to pick her up softly push her forward and encourage her. I'm balancing her off my hands. I might bring my hand to the right, to the left, just to keep her straight and push forward here. You're okay. You're okay. Forward. Good. Good. And just walk. That's the most intense move a lot of young horses have to deal with is that set up and position for that lope off. It is, they know what's going to come next. They learn to anticipate it. 
if they're edgy or sensitive off your leg, it promotes and creates a very um, built up exhilarating experience in their mind. And so we often as riders just position and go, position and go. But if you'll position your horse and not go and practice them just walking and accepting that position, wait till you see how soft they come into the lope off. Wait till you see how much more relaxed the lope off is for them. I've used the TR3 Classic Drag to keep my performance horses at their peak. And now I'm so excited to say that we now have that TR3 E-Series. There just isn't anything better than that TR3 Arena Drag to help make my performance and my program complete. So no matter the size of your program, good footing should matter to you. So contact ABI today and get your Arena Drag.